Hopkins are here. Yay! And Ross Plunkett. <laughs> yeah, because I'm t- streaming on Twitch. So he jumped in. <laughs> We're going to start and get them out of here, folks. So start the old timer. Countdown timer. Yay! <laughs> Hey Ross, what's up, dude? Tim Murray, good evening. Good evening, good evening. I'm streaming on Twitch, I'm streaming on Facebook at the KDHX page, and I'm streaming on YouTube. Watching us on YouTube. He's not watching us on and Twitch. I'm on Facebook at the KDHX page. Forty-two seconds, folks. Forty-two seconds. Showtime, but listen to that. That's what happens in the winter time with your fiddle. Pat will be joining us later in the program to uh, play some accompaniment. I, I ruined your display, Pat. I left the left the thing open in the back. Now I need now I need a note. So I have to turn this piano on to get a note. My fiddle completely fell down, but you know that happens in this weather. <laughs> It's a good night to stay in, though, isn't it? I mean, here it's like been Arctic conditions for days now. It'll probably slip some more. It's the humanity, you know. I've got humanifiers. Humanifiers running all over the house. Humidifiers are running all over the house, but it doesn't seem to do much good. So it's barely keeping uh, the humidity in the mid 20s range. And I think I saw something new on the weather reports today. That is, uh, they're now showing projected interior humidity. And today I saw 17% was the projected interior humidity. So I'm drinking. I'm staying hydrated. I'm drinking some chamomile tea. Usually at this time of the evening, I'd be drinking a glass of wine, but I don't want to be dehydrated tonight. So, but so let's play. We're going to play a tune called Going Down to Cairo. And this is a new series I'm doing with uh, the KDHX Folk School uh, a couple times a month, uh, second and fourth, what's today? Tuesdays, second and fourth Tuesdays. Uh, just play a, a, one of the easier tunes. And so we're, I'm going to draw from the book called Dear Old Illinois, which friends of ours worked on for many years. And it's a beautiful thick book of fiddle tunes collected in Illinois songs too and this is one that's quite popular actually a lot of people may know some rendition of it or not called Going Down to Cairo it comes from a guy named Noah Beavers it's also a, a goodbye Liza Jane I think they call it too sometimes but I learned it from Chirps listening to him play it a long time ago and uh, I think it was on the original one of those original Crick Delters uh, 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 recordings, maybe on their 8-track tape, which we have somewhere. So we're going to play a little bit of uh, 
of uh, going down to Cairo. So let me see if I'm in tune. I'll do it first on the fiddle, and then I'll do it on the mandolin. And then later on, Pat will join us, and we'll play this tune. And maybe we'll play a couple others just for fun to round things out. But So let's play, see how it goes with going down to Cairo. I'm going to check my tuning one more time. And like I say, it may, the whole thing may cr collapse later on. We just don't know because of the humidity or lack thereof. Actually, I'm going to turn my humidifier back on because I, I turned it off for sound, but I think I need the, the air droplet, the water droplets more than I need to control the, audio, the, the uh, a little bit of sound in the background. So there, the humidifier is back on. So let's play Going Down to Cairo. Now, I've got dots right there, but I'm going to change my dots. So don't go totally by these. I Sometimes I'm, I'm torn. Whether, am I going to uh, give you a a uh, true re old timers rendition, or am I going to give you my rendition? And I think I'm going. In this case, I'm going to give you my rendition, which is a little bit different noting, uh, may maybe a few fewer notes actually, but uh, a little more fun to play, I think. So, so you can use this kind of as a guide. The first part's pretty reliable, the A part, but the B part, I ultimately change a little few things. I'll post that up tomorrow or later this evening. Uh, if you're a patron, I'll post it up there. If you want a copy of the music and you're not. You can just email me, bigfiddleshow at gmail.com, and I'll send you a little PDF of the tune for tonight, okay? So, and this will be archived on my Patreon site as well after we're done here today. So let's play a little bit. It's a simple little tune, but it's fun to play. It's a great little jam tune to play with your friends. So here we go with uh, Cairo. I'm going down to Cairo. Okay, so, uh, oh, Kim, I'm glad you're saying you've always wanted to learn this. It's, it's not a hard tune at all, and, and it's fun to play. You, you know, sometimes I think the Camp Possum tunes, I, put, I stretch you, you know, with those. And I wanted to do a little a couple times a month where I just play a tune that, man, you can pick up just like that. So that's what this one is for. And I've got some more in mind. If you had some other little tunes you want to learn, just send me a message by email or uh, with the Patreon site. You can send me a message. But... Uh, so yeah, let's play a little bit of this. I'm going to play it through one more time, slow, and then I'll break it down for you, okay? So let me do, uh, I'm, just, I'm using one camera tonight, so you have to put up with me pulling this thing in and out and readjusting it. So let me get in close where you can see what I'm doing with my fingers. Here we go. Uh, is that a good view? Not too bad, not too bad. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay, I'll give you both a little bit of shot of the view, well, shot of the bow and also the fingers. So the first thing is we're going to play, let's play this unison here. It's uh, uh, or octaves rather, it's uh, D on the A string 
and the open D. That's the first little bit. One more time. And then stay on this D. Closer even here. Watch out, watch out. Okay, here we go. So you repeat that, so let's do that one more time. So what we're doing there is start on this open A. little bit is or that chord or or this unis this uh, octave thing drone drone let's play it through a couple times here we go one two ready play times there I'll play the open A with that D. Okay, here we go. One more time from the beginning. Ready, go. This is an old Noe, Noe Beavers. His, his name's uh, Noah, but the old timers, he called him no, Noe Beavers. He was one of the old boinkers that they recorded. The guy was actually a really, really good fiddle player. He's uh, in the book a lot, and he's on those, there's a three CD set Kim mentioned there. It's a really great set of recordings, all field recordings of the old fiddlers from Illinois. So, okay, one more time here. Facebook. Can you see it? <laughs> is it showing up on Facebook? I hope it is. I can't tell what's... I just throw it out there, you know, and it's ne whatever happens, happens. So right, we're going to do the second part now. So I hope you got most of that. And then when we're done, I'm going to back up and play it a bunch of times through on the fiddle. You just play along with me real slow, kind of loop it around and around. And then we'll play it on the mandolin. So if you missed a note or two, you can get it off the mandolin as well. So here we go with the second part. Let me play through it once.
strip it down to its bare essentials when I show it to you here. And then as I play through it, I'll play some variations and add a few notes in, make it more interesting. But let's just stay with the, the bare essentials right now if we can, all right? So here we go with uh, the second part of going down to Cairo. <laughs> I'm ending up there, on, that's the, in the second bar. Now, again, if you got the dots, I'm not playing exactly from the dots. I'm kind of playing my own rendition. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, I think I'll put out a second version of the dots. That'll be the way I'm showing it to you tonight. But then you still have the Noe Beavers version to look back at too, if you want to add a few notes. So. So let, let, we're just playing. Uh, I've, got, I've got a pickup note. I've got D to F sharp. And then G twice, A twice, B twice, and then a chord. And then... Now that's the same exact thing as we did in the first part, remember? So we're going to steal that measure we already know from the first part. through how we're teaching it all the way through now I'm not going to put in any of the extra notes I'm just gonna we're just playing the bare minimum here by phrase one more time so open D open D to the F sharp that's the pickup notes and then G A B little C and now we can put a little chord in there you can put this a, E below to back up a little bit and I'm just going to play through it a few times on the fiddle by myself here slow and then you can play along and then I'm going to get the mandolin out and we'll do it with the mandolin so let's do that you can see see me back here let's see can you see all of me yeah you can sure can got to check my tuning again if you were what's that Are you looking at I am yes okay I see a pick question oh see I couldn't see it because uh there was uh, some some uh, menu thingy was in the way. Let's see. Can you throw in an e, open E with the C? Is that the question you were asking me about, Pat? Yeah. Yes, you sure could. Uh, she's also, you could do that. I kind of like this better, but you certainly could do that. It's the same note, right? Yep, you can certainly do that. Uh, so sorry I missed your question there, Kim. Uh, let's see. So, but but I, I'm kind of partial to the lower the E on the D string with that C. So it's E on the D string with the C on the A string, and we're in C, and we're in G. So that's a C natural, right? All right. Sorry about that. Do 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 do. Here we go. With uh, I'm going to Cairo. Going down to Cairo. By the way, a little geography lesson. If you don't know where Cairo is. That's in an area where the delta, the big joining of the confluence of two massive rivers, the two, two of the biggest rivers in uh, North America, 
The two biggest are the Missouri and the Mississippi, but down where the Ohio joins in, right at the bottom of, of Illinois, that's right, the, the Ohio River forms that bottom border of Illinois, and it dumps into the Mississippi River. And so there's a town called, in this Delta region, uh, uh, that's called Cairo, Illinois. And some famous blues musicians are from Cairo, Illinois, by the way. But uh, So uh, that's uh, also an area they call Little Egypt, not surprisingly, with a town named Cairo. There's all this other references to Egypt in that few counties down there in southern Illinois. But So uh, we're playing, it's Cairo, not Cairo, by the way. <laughs> So let's go. Let's play a little bit. I'm going down to Cairo. Here we go. Sorry about that. going down to Cairo? I sure am. It's a wonderful place. Go look it up on your map, uh, on, your, on your Google Maps. Cairo, Illinois. All right, so let's play, uh, play it on the mandolin a little bit here. Du, du, du. And then when we come back, uh, uh, after doing it on the mandolin, I'll get Pat to come over here and we'll play through it a few times with the piano. And if she's in a mood to play, we might play a couple other jam tunes just to keep ourselves uh, in good time here. So now I'm going to have to tune the mandolin. As you know, anybody who's joined this program before knows that the mandolin is always out of tune. So let's see if I can get it worked up here. 
This is really lays nicely on the mandolin, so if you're kind of a beginning mandolin player, this is an excellent tune to play. Hang on there. I was playing this with Wichita this afternoon, in fact. Old Wichita and I were playing together over the interwebs today. you want to have the dots for this tune, I have dots and I have mandolin tab. And if you're not a patron at patreon.com forward slash Charlie Walden, where you can get all those dots, you can email me at bigfiddleshow at gmail.com and I will uh, send you the dots. I'll also add you to my mailing list. So that's, a, that's, the, that's the downside of, of emailing me. As I, anybody who emails me, they don't realize it, but they're getting added to my mailing list. Not really. But in this case, I'm warning you in advance. Oh, yes. here. Kate, I've never seen you here before. Thanks. Welcome to the Easy Tunes session. She's watching on Twitch, so there's got a lot of nice people here tonight. Let's get in real close. I'm going to play the tune one more time. I'm going to show the tune one more time. Some people like, you know, the tune shown on the mandolin because they can see a little easier where the notes are, and then they go and get their fiddle out, you know. So, so here we go with k -Rob. I'm going to play it one more time, slow. Here we go. So now let's go phrase by phrase, just like we did with the fiddle. And hey, Ethan, thanks for that like over on Facebook uh, at the KDHX Folk School Facebook page. We're in three places tonight. We're at twitch.tv forward slash Big Fiddle Show. Facebook uh, at the KDHX Folk School Facebook page and also on my YouTube channel, Charlie Walden on YouTube. So here we go with... Do, 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 do. I start right here on this note. And you can play that open D as a drone if you want. quick bit is open A then or you can do this so here we go
first part. Here we go again, the second part. All right, ready? Okay, so let's look at what we're doing there. Start on this G here on the D string. Open A, B on the A string, and then this chord. I like that little chord. It's a C on the A string and then E on the D string. That's D, D, and then this. You know, the nice thing is that we did that in the first part. Sorry. <laughs> but you can just go. Keep it simple. Same thing now, let's push it back here so you can see what I'm doing. And let's play uh, Cairo with the mandolin a few times through here, just like we just jam on it a little bit. Ready? One, two, ready, go. Do something a little different here. Let's put this chord in here. Because since we're gonna play, you know, we don't, we don't have a nice full sound, so we could go. Let's try this. This G on the E string and this D on the on the uh, A string. Kind of gives a little uh, kind of bluegrassy sound. And you can do it on the fiddle too. this part. Hey, that was fun. Maybe Pat would come in here and we could play it a little bit more on the fiddle. And maybe, and maybe a couple other tunes if she's willing. 
All the same crew is here tonight. So let's see if we can play it a couple more tunes. Sweetheart. You have to back it up so I don't look big. How do you... Actually, what do you think? You want to look some tiny? I want to look tiny. Okay, we can make you look tiny. I can make you look as tiny as you want. I need to look you're tiny. tiny. You're tiny now. Trust me. Look, Am see? I tiny? Look, you're tiny. Oh, I'm tiny. You're really tiny. Look how far back she is. Oh! I'm so tiny. It's the miracle of movie magic I'm making sure you tiny. Piano, though. I think I already have it on because I was yeah. playing earlier. I was finding notes. I feel a little loud, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you so had it I... cranked pretty loud. Well, so. that's about where I usually have it. All right, here we go. So, here we go. Okay. D G G. That's how it should sound. That's a good tempo, but let's play it a little slower just because a lot of you just learned it. So, but that's a, that's actually a, that'd be a nice jam session tempo right there. It was very relaxed, but still, we're, it wasn't so slow that it was making us want to go yeah. home. We're <laughs> supposed to lead a slow jam this month. I know. How's that going to work out? I don't know how that's going to happen. Yeah, we're, we're, we're there on the slow jam fizz, if that's what it's called. Uh, uh, January 28th. So, that's on Facebook. So. But hey, you know, tomorrow night is uh, is the Camp Possum Wednesday Jam session and too it's Charlie's on YouTube, 65th and it's also my birthday. Yeah, woo! Yeah. Thank you, Medicare. <laughs> we think Medical, Medica, Meta something. <laughs> All right, let's play it. Oh, let's let's play a little bit slower. A couple times, couple three times through here. All right, here. So cut down to Cairo. was pretty fun. I think you got a new tune tonight that you can all play. Wake up in the morning and see if you can play it after you've been asleep all night. So, 
Let's let's play let's play one or two more here just this to just for fun. This tune is on number two on Daryl Pelanoia. Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, I, you know, I, sure I, I need to drag my chat down. I'm missing yeah. a lot of chat. Oh, I'm missing a lot of chat. I'm missing a lot of chat. Oh, Kate, Medicine, names. San Diego, yeah. and Thomas Coriel. He's here. He's going down to Cairo. Every, he's here too. A lot of people are going down to Cairo. Well, I had to pull the chat down. I didn't realize it was going on. It wasn't scrolling automatically. A lot of people are here tonight. Holy cow. Denison from Arkansas. All right, man, good. Oh, I think he's a bot. Oh, he's a bot. We got a bot tonight. He's a bot. Oh, I welcome. Still don't see. Who did welcome you say all was here? bots. Uh, Th Thomas Coriel. I don't see him yet. Oh, he's on Facebook. See, you're le you're not watching on Facebook. No, I'm watching yeah. on YouTube. Yeah, you're, she's watching on YouTube. There's three platforms. Jim's here. We're, we're, I'm lucky to keep track we're of But yeah, there's a bot here tonight. I like to welcome all the bots here bot. tonight. Yeah, he's a bot. <laughs> Oh, fancy it up. Yes, that's, it's time to play it fancy yeah. it up. Fancy it up. All right, so with the, with all the extra notes. So here we go. But that was the basic version. That'll get you by. But yeah, you can put more notes in it. Not, it's not a real fancy tune, but let's see what we can do. Up in there, I hit a few clams. That was actually that was true improvisation. That was not an arrangement. So that the, no. da the danger in that is that you might hit a few bad notes, but that's okay. Definitely not an arrangement. <laughs> oh, Alistair's here. Oh, good man. Hello, Scotland. Well, a lot of a lot of nice people showed up tonight to watch us. We better play a couple more since we got we got yeah. a, we draw drew a crowd and they've got their fiddles out. We drew so a crowd. We drew a crowd and they got their fiddles out. So let's see what we, we got, got here. Flannel shirt on. Yeah, He's we're both got his we're both lumberjacks. Shirt on. In here. We're lumberjacks and that's okay as the song goes. Right. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> ah. But the, oh Lord. Alright, so we'll stay in G here. Yeah, and people could make requests. They could certainly make requests. We're totally Although open. I'm only to, looking at YouTube. I'm looking at it all. I'm looking at it all. Any of the rest <laughs> of it. You know. Thank you, Kate. Says oh, it's fun to watch. 8th of January. That's a good idea. Oh, that's a good idea. That's in D. We're going to D then. For the banjoists out there. Are you going to sing all the verses? I'm not going to sing it at all. What, no, what key? D. But you said going to G, but we're... No, I said I'm going to D. I said I'm going to D. <laughs>
had to let her go, folks. I can't hold her back, you know. There's no. Yeah, hold... we're gonna lead a slow jam. There's no oh, holding yeah, her back. For sure, we're gonna be able to do hey, that. Hey, greetings from York County, Pennsylvania. I've been to York County. By gosh, I've We've been, been everywhere, man. I've, I've been to York County. I've been to. I've been, uh, Beth's here. Good evening, Beth. I've been to. What's that? Winnemucca. I've been Hello, to Winnemucca. Eugene, by the way. Beth Rex. Ra raise your hand if you've been to Winnemucca, please. We've been to Winnemucca. We've been to Winnemucca. I got pictures. Right before the flies descended. Yeah. Oh, there's Thomas. <laughs> Facebook. Yeah. Yeah, the audio was weird on Facebook. Yeah, Facebook is, uh, <laughs> I don't know, it's, it, they got issues. Yeah, but, yeah. well, they, got, they have one issue that you mentioned the name of, but we won't go, we won't go into that. <laughs> one note solo rule. Yes, of course they did. <laughs> That, so I think nice. I I think I heard Johnny Gimbel talking one time about soloing, and he says, "If you find one note that's good, lean on it. Lean, just what, lean on it." What the heck? It's dramatic. And let the chords go on behind yeah, you. You see, right. that's, it's, it's dramatic. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> lean on that note. They call it forcing in the jazz world, I believe. Okay, so let's play another yeah. one. We're in D. We can I play another one in D. That. Is there any more requests? We're going to play Johnny Don't Come Home Drunk if there's no more requests right now. Let's... You be thinking, folks. That's in D. That's in D. I think you got Pat wound up now. We're not stopping anytime soon. So just... <laughs> She was really bored. The TV, are. she was watching TV oh, and no. getting bored. I'm communicating with three people at once. T texting three people uh, at once. How to redo their house. Our son's moving. Oh, the stuff he's he moving to give us back. He's moving? Oh, yeah, he's moving. Where's he moving to? Upstairs. Oh. To a smaller apartment. Well, he's not giving any of his stuff back. I got news oh, for yeah, him. Oh, yeah, he is. He I got is. news for him. What about this blue glass lamp? You mean the one my parents gave me in 1971? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that, that you can back. have back. Where are you that? All right, Johnny, don't come home drunk. And the key of D. As Kim says, YouTube, that's where the cool people are. That's right. Everybody come on over to YouTube here. Barb Rosner. Wow. All right. Hey, Barb. <laughs> Welcome, Kentucky. <laughs> yeah, I love that low part of uh, uh, low part of uh, uh, Johnny Don't Come Home Drunk. I think John Williams does that, too. We both learned it. Stole it from Pete. Oh, Walter and Wanda are here. Oh, wow. All right. All right. You um, know, you know. They're 20. I don't know what minus 23C is. Uh, that's cold, but not that cold. It, it's cold. Here. It's cold. But you know, uh, centigrade and uh, a little physics lesson: centigrade and Fahrenheit <laughs> intersect at minus forty. So that gives you an idea. They they both they cross minus at minus forty. 40. Yeah. That's zero. No, minus forty it's Fahrenheit hot. and minus forty C are the same temperature. Oh. Minus forty Fahrenheit's mighty cold. Yeah. 
It's mighty cold. Yeah, it's mighty cold. And minus 23C is pretty cold, too, because that's, yeah, that's getting down there. That's getting down there. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, everybody. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. man, yeah. Are we having fun yet? Oh, it's only minus fun. 19 in St. John. No, that's not, well, you got that water to keep, all that water there to keep you warm. Yeah, in they're, they're John. tempered by the ocean. They, they got the, the Bay of Fundy is there, I think. No, 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 no. Yeah, the St. John, St. John, New Brunswick. Is the, right I on the Bay of Fundy. It's right on the Bay of I think, is that right? No. Is it right on? Yes, it's right on the, yes, right on the well, Bay of Fundy. Well, they'll I think. tell I think us. they'll tell us, but I believe it they'll is. They'll tell us. <laughs> I could have my Canadian geography all messed up. Yes. All right, so another tune. Uh, how, uh, no suggestions. We're going to pick one. We're going to pick one here. Uh, in the key of D. Yeah. The key of D. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that means. But yeah, no, it's not linear. Yeah, the, the no, degrees. It's, no, it's the, you, you add 35, you're It's, it's yeah. an MX plus B problem, yeah, as we it say. Is. It's, it's, it's an algebraic. It's an algebraic equ equation. Conundrum. Well, let's play a little. Everybody likes to play St. Anne's Reel. Let's play a little bit of that. And then, and with the. Uh, with uh, t also the woodchopper's hoedown. Of course. So play the St. Anne first, okay? And then you're gonna show off that lick. You're gonna, just, everybody wants you to play that, yeah, show them that lick on the piano. It. Everybody wants to see that. That'll have to be in your next see. piano lesson. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> well, yeah, 
Crooked Stovepipe. Yeah, that's a good one. We'll play that. Oh, that's a lovely one. That's a lovely one. one. I got my guitar ready. Think I'm going to play along for a few rounds. Okay, good (laughs) good on you there. (laughs) What's 873? What's 8? It's not so cold. 8 center. No, that's up in the 40s, actually. That's a low 40s, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, you don't. It's not freezing there. No, no, not freezing, yeah. Mouth of Topeka. It's a Lost nice... Indian. Crickets don't okay. Yeah, that's good. We got, got ser- we got serious requests. Bay of Fundy. Where's that? Oh, no, that's just talking about the Bay of Fundy. <laughs> no, that was you talking about No, but about now Kim's talking about the Bay of Fundy, too. Yeah, no. Well, oh, there's some there's some people watching on Twitch. That's excellent. If you're on Twitch, try to be a follower for you. Give, give me a yeah. follow if you're on oh, Twitch, my guys. Oh, happy birthday. Oh, well, it's thank tomorrow. you. It's tomorrow, yes. Happy birthday. Yeah, it's tomorrow. All right, so you made we got... it to Medicare. I made it to Medicare. Right? It's the big 65. <laughs> yeah. Malvi Tobeeks, yes. And when we can, we'll have a big party. If That's right. In a year or two, when we can, when I, we'll when have I was, a big party. Go look for it on YouTube. Too. When I was 60, <laughs> we had a, I, had a, yeah. I, had, I was new to live streaming. I had a six-hour live stream of my party. We had 99 people come through the door. In the, in the one evening. So. We didn't know some of them. Some of them we didn't. There was a guy there, there from, was France. from France. We didn't know who he was, but no, he was a nice man, so we talked to him. Well, did we? Yeah, I talked to him okay. quite a bit, yeah. I mean, there were 40 people in the basement. I never made it to the basement. There was a big jam going on in the basement. You never even never heard. Never made it huh? to the basement. All right, so let's play a little bit of the mouth mouth of the toe beak. Thanks, Thomas. <laughs> mouth of the oblique. Yeah, if you're watching us on Twitch, give me a follow. I need more followers on Twitch to make things happen over there. So Yeah, I miss follower. How many followers do you have? I have like 50 or something, I think. Yeah. What's the other one that I'm your only second follower on? Uh, There's something else. Maybe TikTok. It might be TikTok. <laughs> I'm usually only follower on TikTok. I've kind of given up on TikTok for right now. We're not TikTok kind We're of not tick people. Pe- we're not TikTok people, though. No. Mouth of the toe beak. Here we go. G G G.
that's a good one, boy. Oh, it is. Oh, good. that's a good. That's a good. That's a good. Yeah. Woo wee. Yeah. Mouth of the oblique, as we're gonna, we call it here. If we're gonna keep playing, I have to. I'm gonna have to get something stronger to drink than chamomile want? tea. Yeah. You, you want a <laughs> red wine? -E -R -R. I can get you some red yeah, wine. She's there. going for. She's going for the. Gonna get me a little wine to drink though. So, because we're gonna. Be, I think we're gonna be here a while. She's having a good time, aren't you? Oh yeah. She's having fun, folks. I'm real happy. She's a happy little girl. I'm real happy. <laughs> yes, Pat was like Paul McCartney. <laughs> Let's see, uh, what was the other? Oh, Crooked Stovepipe. Yeah, let's play that. And Lost Indian. We'll play both of them. Yes. All oh, those fiddle tunes. What are, you, what are you gonna do, you know? Oh, yeah, we got. Oh, thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. Thank you. I don't have any alerts, crazy alerts set up, but. Uh, you don't? Okay, yeah. go. No, I used to have crazy alerts set up, but I... It's they, a real wine glass. That's Be a, careful. I'm not used to drinking out of an Be actual careful. wine. It's a, it's a, not only that, it's a Waterford wine glass. Oh my it gosh. I think, no, it is. Waterford. It's a Waterford wine glass. Yeah, it might be. Uh, Usually I drink like a thimble full of wine at a time. This is an actual uh, serving. Out of, out of a juice glass. Or, or, yeah, or, or, or a little old, yeah. or old fashioned whiskey glass. Or a sippy cup. That's a, those are breakable that, things. That unbreakable kid's sippy yeah. cup. All right, let's see if we can play that. I love that tune. You can finally keep up the pace after 10,000 times through. That's what well, it takes, that's Walter. What it takes. That's exactly what it takes. That's exactly what it takes. <laughs> yeah. it, it's, you know, it, it's not instant gratification I, to I, learn to play I, the fiddle. I love, I love, this, I love this handle on, uh, on Twitch. Shine Anyway 09. <laughs> that's really a cool name. <laughs> Hey, you know what, though, I just want to mention, I want to mention, tomorrow night is the jam session, the Wednesday night jam session. If you're, if you're watching us on some other platform than YouTube, you may not know about it. It's at 8 o'clock p.m. tomorrow on Central my, time. Central Time on my YouTube channel. And then on, on Saturday morning. What about Friday? Well, Friday's the big fiddle show, but I don't have a, I don't have a graphic for that. We so. don't know what we're doing yet. We don't know what we're doing, but we are doing a big fiddle show on Friday because we have to start the name that tune contest. We do. We have to re restart it. But oh. but on Saturday, yeah. I'm doing the German Stop Waltz, which is an old waltz from Dwight Lamb, and it's also one that your grandfather played. It's on that old recording of him. Wow. It's the, he called it the Stop Waltz, and he. He, the, Pat has this old recording of her grandfather playing, the 70s. and and it's it's kind of hit or miss. He was trying to remember tunes, and he play, he started it. He actually played the first part, and then he couldn't quite play the second part. But it's exactly the same tune that Dwight played. He would have been in his nineties. So, well, so I figure that must have been a popular tune in the Midwest at some time. Oh yeah, because they had a family band, and they played for all the square dances yeah, but it's around a, Galesburg, Knoxville, Illinois. But it's a really cool tune. It's got to play, and they call it the Stop Waltz because. I'm not going to play it for you tonight. I will save I'll save it in reserve for Friday night. But there's a place where you stop the fiddle stops and the accompaniment keeps going. It sounds really cool. Yeah, that's a really very cool tune. So that, that's on uh, Wednesday. That's on Saturday morning at 11 a.m. So yeah, don't miss that. Okay, we're going to play Crooked Stovepipe. Here we go. I'm just moving. Oh, Westphalia. Yes, we'll do that after here. We'll do Westphalia waltz after this. Oh, we skip Lost Indian, too. Walt, Walter says, well, Lost we'll get back to it. Walter's going to break out the wine, too, he said. Yeah, well, of course. It's it's cold. You oh. need something to keep you, you need, warm. You need to get, you know? yeah, you need to get It's cold up there. Minus 23. I'm going to have to look up it's what that so is. It's so much worse Somebody look there. up what that is Fahrenheit, but that's it's cold. So that's worse. cold. Okay, so... So hi to Walter and Wanda there, both of you there.
Yeah. I want to play the Bay of Fundy before we're done here, too. Crown Royal is better after work tomorrow, so wine it is. <laughs> yeah, if you got to work tomorrow. But those are the ones with the... The little velvet, velvet bag. The velvet. That's Canadian whiskey. Well, they're not velvet, but they're felted bags. Felt, yeah, but that's Canadian whiskey. Yeah, Crown we had Royal, friends right? that saved all those bags, and I think they made a quilt out of well, them. Well, and also, people just would the use beans. them to store stuff. The beans. Well, yeah. You could put they stuff, could you know. You could store stuff Yeah, you could put in. things in it, you know. Yeah. And that's Canadian whiskey, right? I can't, I Crown Royal, phone. I believe, is Canadian I whiskey. I believe it is. worked at all. Yeah, Crown Royal's good, but we used to you drink. He says it's minus eight Fahrenheit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's cold. That's yeah, cold, buddy. That's cold. That's cold. Yeah, we used to go up to Dwight Lamb's house up for New Year's Eve up in up in Western Iowa, and it got really cold up there on New Year's Eve, and always well, below. Because he's almost in Dakotas. Almost, yeah, he's, he's almost in a into, few miles. And so it, yeah, in the it would be below zero, and so he yeah. kept a, a gallon of Canadian Club in, in his refrigerator. So did my it, parents. It, 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 it actually <laughs> kept it in the freezer. He did? A gallon of Canadian <laughs> Club in the freezer, or it must have been a half gallon. I don't think I've ever seen a gallon, but it was a big, big bottle. They wasn't sell a, them. It wasn't a fifth, yeah. and so and then we he doled that out to you, you know. <laughs> that warmed you right up. I'm telling you, it was frozen though. It, it was it was just it was like yeah, it was like at 20, 20 degrees or something out of his freezer in his rec room there. So well, big fun. That's how you survive in the northern climate. That's right. That's right. It is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, how about a little bit of Westphalia Waltz, and then we'll do Walter's uh, Lost Indian. So we'll take any other requests, and I and I might play that Bay of Fundy just for fun, you know. Of course, it's a good tune. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. Remember what the first three changes are? It's that one six three thing. I think. Oh, that's beautiful. Lovely. All right, here we go. One, two, three, one, two.
Oh, you tore that up, Pat. Man, you tore that up. I'm telling you right now. Woo! Yeah, all right. I know that one. <laughs> I know that one. Inside out. Fireball whiskey. Oh, yeah. You know, that's what they give oh, us Lord. over at Leduc's tent. They always... Well, everywhere. Everybody. Yeah, and, 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 at, and at Lem Lemelins, they had it. And, Everybody had it. But usually at Leduc tent, there's somebody's walking around every evening with the fireball whiskey. Well, yeah, everywhere. They that's had tough. The fireball. Hey, Fart Simulator's here. And, and they liked, um, what is it, the Jack Daniels Honey? Oh yeah, the Jack Daniels they honey. They like that. The yeah, and apple. Honey. Jack Daniels apple too. I didn't like. even know that. Oh yeah, there's apple. an apple. Yeah. yeah hey, I'm Fart Simulator's apple. here. What's up, Fart Simulator? <laughs> Rex Elifritz. All right. <laughs> Rex says Uncle Pete kept his old tailor in the freezer, like Dwight too. <laughs> old tailor. That's hard. That's pretty tough stuff. Marion from Columbus saying hello. All right. <laughs> Man, we got a lot of people here tonight. Pat, Pat, where'd you go? She, I think she went down to the. We, what we call the beer fridge, so she'll be right back. But man, I'm telling you, I'm having a good time here. A lot of nice folks visiting us. Fart similar, I'd do a raid, but I can't do raids when I'm on uh, when I'm on uh, uh, Twitch multi streaming. I have no access or or sorry, Streamlabs. I'm multi streaming on Streamlabs. So that fireball whiskey is only good for survival purposes. Yeah, depending on what depends on what you're trying to survive, you know. <laughs> I'm not sure. There's some things you couldn't survive with that. So let's try. Let's see if I can think of that. Uh, oh, oh, we're gonna do uh, Lost, Lost Indian. Indian. such a great tune i'll have to i'll have to play that for you i'll play that for you tomorrow or friday because that is uh oh fart underscore simulators offline for maintenance hmm but you know if you haven't been to twitch.tv forward slash fart underscore simulator don't go there now they're down for maintenance but man that site just keeps getting better and better and better and you don't want to miss out on <laughs> on what's going on with the fart simulator i'm telling you right now yeah, people are clamoring to get into the fart simulator, but oh, uh, clamoring. she read the whole thing yeah. and now she's adding things back. Okay, that's good. Hello, Sherry. And Alistair says hi to Sherry and Marion. Marion, are you here? Ma Hello, yeah, she, I think she's with a friend. She's w watching oh, oh, with a friend. Oh, all right, all right. Excellent. <laughs> it's down from time to 
time. Yeah, the simulator. Well, but... it's it's always getting improved, you know. Yeah. It's, it's uh, you know, any, like any any great work of art, it needs improvement. It's a work of art. Needs some burritos. <laughs> yes, the burritos go good with the fart underscore simulator, by the way. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> okay, so I was going to play... I found in another update. It becomes more useless with every update. <laughs> You know, you know, Thomas. I will play back in '89 t tomorrow night or Friday for That's, sure. I can't. I never heard of back it's a, in it's a, it's a, it's a a Lyman Enlow tune. 1889. Yeah, wait, 1889. I'll tell you the story. Well, I'll tell the story tomorrow when I play the tune. What's the story? It's got a nice story. It's no, got a nice story. Tell me the story. Well, you okay. Can't last that long. He was playing a tune at WOS Radio in Jefferson City, and there was a guy there who was a veteran of World War One. Captain Jack Heine was his name. He was the he was the announcer. And he and Lyman got ready to play a tune. He, he said, "What's it called?" And he said, "I don't know what to call it." And he said, "Well, let's just call it Back in '89." And that's what, <laughs> it's a great title for a tune. Back, I'm sure they meant '1889. I'm sure it's they, a good title because Captain Jack would have been alive in '89. <laughs> now I can't, I couldn't red, dredge it up right now, but it, it's a darn good tune, man. It's a darn good tune. Hey, let's play a little bit of uh, what was I going to play? Oh, Bay of Fundy. Yeah, let's play a little oh, bit of it. Yeah. Carol, do I know any Carolina chocolate drops? I, they may. Oh. Let me put it this way: they may know some of my tunes, but I don't know they any might. of their tunes. But that, that, that's kind of a different repertoire. But if you is have it, a, if you have a tune you want to suggest, I'll but see I if love I know. Their stuff. Oh, they're great! They're great! Yeah. They're, they're I real inter stuff. they're real entertainers too. They're real musicians. Oh man, I'm messing it. Got it. All right, here yeah. we go with the Bay of Fundy. I was going to have to sing it to you. It would have been pretty. The highest, it have been pretty. The, the biggest tides Ooh. in the world there. Yep. Twice a day. wrote that it's apparently. It's a wonderful place. Yeah. Oh, it's a beautiful We've place. We've been there. We've been there. We've we been were there. set we, to kayak. We, we, we stayed at the Bay of Fundy. We were set to it, kayak. But it was too but rough that day. The conditions, they, wouldn't let they us called go. it up. They called it up. But we were at Advocate Harbor, if you know where we that were. is. 
staying in. And the, the, the tide goes out. It goes out so far that yeah. they say, don't walk out to the edge of it because when it comes back in, it comes You're back in so fast. It. I mean, it's you like, can't run fast it like goes out a mile. I mean, you know, it's, it was amazing. And and then there yeah. was the Dory Rips. The Dory where Rips. The, I mean, the place oh, the place, is it's just, There's so much to see there. And there's so you many have, trees. And yeah, tides from three directions. Beautiful. Dory Rips. So beautiful. It's just crazy. And then there's this thing we walked up to that said, don't come up here. It's too loud. Yeah, well, no, there was a foghorn there warning severe <laughs> right. ear damage. Until and, you get and like, up to it. And you to, but you see don't it. see the sign until you get up to it. So I guess if the foghorn goes off while you're standing there, your ears start to bleed. They should have like a light that turns on or something before they start the foghorn. Because you're standing right next to it and then you see this tiny sign. Don't come near here, you know, <laughs> warning severe ear damage. Uh, yeah. It was. <laughs> old Dubuque, old Doobie Q. Let's see. Oh man, old Doobie Q. Well, that's the same as Dubuque, ain't it? Yeah. That's the same as Dubuque. I better, I better table that one for and, a next time. But I can Bailey's play. Bailey's breakdown, which is like Dubuque. A little bit. I, I'll play the old Countryman's reel in B flat. Let's play that, and then we'll play Bailey's. So, let's see. We'll play the old Countryman here. <laughs> One more time. First part. No, just play this. Go right. Played that in ages. That's a tough tune. I'm telling. You. That's one of the tough tunes right there. That's a tough. That's tune. a high maintenance tune. Uh, yeah. That's what we call those. It's a <laughs> high maintenance tune. The tide is okay if you know the pinch points, but you definitely have to know them. The foghorns are what get get us the tourist pocket change. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, brandy wine. That's a good tune. That's why I hired the best kayak people in Fundy. They were from Sweden or somewhere, actually. They weren't Canadian. No, but even. they had a five-star They five were from Norway rating. or somewhere. Yeah, they were good. They, yeah, they sea, were, sea they kayaking. They were not going to let us die. No, they don't want you to go out no. when the water's too rough if you're an amateur. Yeah. Amateur. How about a little bit of that Bailey's Breakdown, and then I'll try to play Brandywine. That's a Kenny Baker tune in G. Is it? Yes. Mm. Is, is it now? Is it? Thank you. 
That's Gerald, a great Gerald tune. Bailey. That's a great yeah, tune. Bailey's Breakdown. Brandywine. Now, let's see if I can render that. That's, uh, hey, Bruce is here. Bruce, what's up, dude? And thank you for the happy birthday wish, man. I really appreciate it. My All right. Phone's working. You can't make it. Everything's work? upside down. You need a new phone. Sideways. Dude. It did we can another. Spring. It did another update. So now it's almost <laughs> completely useless. Lo I love those updates. Yeah, you gotta love those updates. Oh, Lord. When it oh. kills, when it kills your device, when it updates, then you know you've, every time, you've got good service. Every time. Now when I have phone messages, every three words are repeated three times in a row. Every so three you words. Not well, understand you know, you, anything. You, you know what we'll do? We will. We will uh, get you a new phone, honey. We'll get you How a new phone. How are we going to do that? Just order it from Cricket, and they'll deliver it with a new SIM card with your phone number already on it, and blah, blah, blah. Well, we'll see. <laughs> and blah, blah, blah. All right, let's go with uh, uh, Brandywine. Oh, man, let's see. <laughs> I'm glad you like that tune, Rex. That's a good. That's I haven't thought of that in a long time. The old countryman's reel. That's one of the tough tunes that Cyril used to play, man. All right, all right. Let's see. He played it left-handed. Okay, let's. Uh, so let's see if I can think. Uh, yeah, he played it left-handed over the bass, like Thomas. Like Thomas. Yeah. So this goes G right well, to wait, C. What did it find? Brandy one. It it's, does the same thing in G. both parts. It goes G, right to C, back to G, to D, you know, kind of like that. In the, so it's in that vein. So we're in G. We're in and G. We're going to go to G to C. Yes, yes. And back to G. Yes. That's what you're telling me, right? Yes, yes. I believe so. All right. Time. Give me, give me another chance. Kenny Baker. Oh no, that works all the way through. Any yeah. tune that goes to the four chord first, you can probably apply Texas rules. Pat, will Pat play the Roosevelt video? I don't think I have the Roosevelt video on on this oh, setup here. Let's see if he I do. Let's have, see. No, yeah. I don't have it. No. You gotta get Roosevelt. 
gross enough to. I gotta get real. I'll, I'll, I'd rather There's be. There's so many people that need to be gross enough. <laughs> oh no, that's really the wrong picture. Where's the camera? There it is. Yeah. I'd, I'd rather be. I'd rather be uh, Ponderosa now. <laughs> I like the Ponderosa <laughs> video better than the Roosevelt video now. I, where at the end Paul says, "Well, I don't, I don't know what to say, boys. I'm overwhelmed." <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna become a new audio meme. People I, want the girl in left behind me. Sure, that's a good one. Meme. Oh, they want the girl. Sure. Oh, at the end of each tune, yeah, they want yeah, the girl left uh, behind me. I meme. hear it in my head now. <laughs> Even though we've been doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday! Picnic Bird. Picky Burpee. Picky Burpee. That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. A bar room. A Ten nights in a bar room. Yeah. Ten. Yeah. Let's play a little bit of that. That's right. Or, yeah. Yeah. Ten nights in the bar. You know the difference between an elephant fart and a bar room? Yeah. No. I'm no. Do no. It. An elephant. You know that's already messed the joke up. You did. You know the, ele the difference between an elephant <laughs> fart and a tavern is a tavern is a bar room and an elephant fart is a bar room. Yeah. You messed that's, it up. I already messed the joke up. <laughs> better here. You better get me some more wine. <laughs> Oh, uh, we're not done here, folks. No, we're not done here. Not yet. Lead out, yes, we'll play a little lead out. Yep. <laughs> or the tune, otherwise known as the tune with a thousand names. I think we've actually collected like fifteen names for this tune. And actually, the guys when the guys who were collecting those dear old Illinois tunes, they went around to all these old timers, and somebody'd say, just for as a for instance, oh, there's an old boy down the road who knows a tune called. A very really interesting Fetch. tune. Yeah, called, you know, Hell on the Wallbash or something. They'd get there and the guy would get out his fiddle and go. <laughs> and every time they went for, you know, to get some really unusual, great sounding tune title, the guy would get out his fiddle and go. <laughs> every time. Hey, <laughs> that every was time. the tune. Well, you know. It's a very ubiquitous tune. And it's popular, yeah. too. Yeah, this is Charlie's big birthday. This is 65. Yeah, man. It's <laughs> Medicare. But for the pandemic... You made I'd, it to Medicare. But for the pandemic, I'd be having a massive party. I think tomorrow, actually, I'll post a link to the, the 60th birthday party. It goes on for six... It's a six-hour live stream. It is. And we had 99 people in this house, I swear to God. There were yeah, so many people between here. Between the floors. You had, and you had the back blocked, so you had the cake and the, and the champagne service in the back of the kitchen. I, I know. I mean, you could and you couldn't walk through here, but this was a little music area, and uh, you know, one group of people. First, Irish musicians would play, then old time musicians oh, would play. Miss Carol only got to play three tunes before she was pushed out. Right, yeah. And and there was a, there was a interpretive well, dance too. Yes, it was. A, people loved the interpretive. I think Walter. I think Walter was at that party. Oh, he, they watched all of they it. They watched the whole thing. They yeah. Did. It was an interpertive dance was the best when part. When we can, there'll be another massive part. Yeah, we'll have we'll have another yeah. bit go at it here. And you're all invited. Everybody's invited. And if you can't make it, we'll put it on the on the TV so you can watch it. But, all right, what, what are we gonna play? Ten nights in a bar in a bar room. In a bar room. <laughs> and then smash the windows and then too. Smash That's the right. Windows.
There you go. There you have it. There you have it, folks. Smash the windows. Let's see. Like the stateroom scene in Night at the Opera with the Marx Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of our parties look like that, actually. Right. Yeah. There was no room for. There was no room for any. They couldn't have squeezed. You couldn't have literally squeezed one more person. People had to leave before someone else could come in. It was pretty much like that. You, and then the kitchen where the food was and the beer you, and the beer you could literally could not walk through you had to just like go around the other way and try to sneak in yeah there was jamming in every room too different yeah. music in every room it was great fun and this house is not that big but there was a lot of people no. here no. <laughs> <laughs> there was a ton of people here yeah I'll, I'll put that up a link to that up tomorrow on Facebook you can take a gander at the 60th birthday party all right let's try a little bit yeah, of that smash the windows is a good one Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good birthday here. <laughs> All right, here we go. What keys is it? D. D key and D, key and D, key and D. Yeah. Hey. John, and then Johnny, bring the jug around the hill. That's a good one, too. What's that? That's an A. You probably never heard it. No. <laughs> Bring the jug, man. Let's see if I can think how that goes. You don't look or act like 65. Yeah, don't look a day over 80. <laughs> you don't look a day over 80. Oh, man. Hey, I think. And then, then it's got like a weird third part that's like half length that kind of goes to a D. Then what goes once goes to a D at the beginning? Sort of, I don't know. Well, we'll find out. It goes. It's kind of it's weird. It's got a little thing. I don't know. Yeah, that's weird. It's weird, but she'll sort it out. Good luck to me. Good luck to Pat. Here we go. But the rest of it's rules. Oh, <laughs> 
stays on A. And that funny part. Back to the beginning. You're kidding me. No, it's just that one weird little part. <laughs> it's not even two measures. It's a, I know, it's two bars. Yeah, it's like oh, two bars. Right. It's a strange, I told you it was a weird tune. Come on. Oh my God. I warned you, it was a weird tune. Here we go, one more time. Straight crooked tune. You know, so it's, yeah, it is. It's like straight, but it's crooked. But it's, but it's not crooked, really. It's just got a short part, but the short part is weird. Yeah. yeah. Oh, good day. Oh man. <laughs> Woo. All right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, never acting our age. I don't even see half of the things you're looking at. <laughs> well, because you're not on. I'm looking well, at. I'm, only on one I'm, platform. I'm looking at what we call okay. mu multi-stream chat. I'm looking at multi-stream chat. So. All right, let's play one more, and I think we're going to let these good folks go home. What do you say? Well, yeah, of okay. course, <laughs> of course. What should be? Yeah. Something in A here, but I'm, I'm stuck in A here. Yes, yes, yes. You got Miller, one. Miller's name Campbell. What else is an A? Uh, trip to Windsor. Trip to Windsor. What else is an A? Uh, what about Angus? Agnes Camel. Sure. Yeah, Agnes, Agnes Camel. Here we go. <laughs>
thanks everybody. That was fun. Remember going down to Cairo? That was it seems that was uh that was almost two hours ago we played going was down it? to Cairo. Yeah. Was it? Yeah. This has been fun though. So we'll, we'll do this again. We'll teach another tune, easy tune on this on the fourth Tuesday. So it's the second and fourth Tuesdays on this. Uh, and and if you if you're on Facebook, go to the KDHX St. Louis Folk School and give them a like. And uh, if you're on Twitch. Give me a follow at twitch.tv forward slash Big Fiddle Show. And, of course, Utah. But now, yeah, and get on my TikTok. There's no, I, I, there's no twerking on my channel, though. There's no, no, twer no. no twerking at all. Twick talk. Or the, or the, or the, the tick, the trick trock is what we like, like to call it. So, all right, folks. I really appreciate you coming up tonight and seeing us. So we'll catch you next time. And tomorrow night at uh, Wednesday night, 8 o'clock on YouTube. So time to say bye-bye, Pat. I'm saying bye-bye. Exactly. Say bye-bye. We're in the little, over here's partner. your little box. I gotta, I gotta make it not matter. It's a TV. It's a, uh, this is a different box. Join your hands in the circle to the left. Let's see if I can adjust the size of this box. The other way back in the same old track. There we are. There we are. See? We're in the box. That's not the swing when you get home. There you wait. Swing your own. We're waving. 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 We're waving.